It's been one week since the legislature passed the bill banning Nashville's Community Oversight Board and similar ones in other cities across the state, but the bill still has not gone into effect. That's because the legislative website shows Governor Lee still has not signed it. News Channel 5's Jason Lamb spoke to the Metro Community Oversight Board's director about a potential legal battle ahead. Depending on where this goes, there'll be, again, strategy that could result in another call for action. At what could have been one of the Community Oversight Board's last meetings this week, members pleaded with Governor Lee not to sign the bill abolishing the board and others across the state looking into police complaints and shootings. Send this bill back and make them get it right. Sheila Clemens Lee pushed for Metro's Community Oversight Board after a Metro police officer shot and killed her son, Jacques Clemens. I'm pleading to Governor Lee, do not sign that bill. I'm asking you as a mother who has lost a child. And today, the board's director didn't rule out a lawsuit saying a bill getting rid of the Community Oversight Board runs counter to what Nashville voters approved not even five years ago. I think that any voter who has voted for the Community Oversight Board is a potential litigant. So um, I, I, I don't know for certain what people are going to do, um, but I think that there are def definitely different paths, um, you know, once if the bill is signed. Jason Lamb, News Channel 5. The bill abolishing the board would go into effect in July after the governor signs it.